We gotta do our part to save the bees, you guys. Check out our interview with director Miriam Hinane about her documentary on the subject. Before we introduce our human guest, I want to acknowledge the huge glass observation beehive in the studio, which has been generously provided by BillsBees.com. They're here to raise awareness, but also to make sure none of us speak out of turn. And here to share her knowledge with us is Miriam Hinane. <laughs> She's an investigative journalist and director of the documentary Vanishing of the Bees. Can you tell us why the honeybees are disappearing? Yes, um, in, in a nutshell, it's uh, these newfangled type of pesticides called systemic pesticides. So the old types of pesticides, you'd spray them on, but these are actually entrenched in the seed and in the soil or dipped in the seed. And so they uptake into the plant and then the bees take back the pollen and nectar and store it. And then these poisons affect the future generations. They're nicotine based. They affect the navigational capabilities. So how, what are we gonna do to help the honeybees thrive? We can do lots of things. We advocate education as the first step towards affecting change. So we in encourage people to watch our film. It's on Netflix, for instance. We can vote with our fork. We can um, plant bee-friendly plants like rosemary and lots of others, lavender, so forth. We can uh, shop at, we can go to farmer's markets and uh, we can stay away from the poisons because these poisons aren't just killing bees, they're also killing beings as well. They're affecting our human brain development. What the beekeepers are doing is they split the hive. So they put an artificial queen, and so they're constantly like basically trying to keep up, but it's not sustainable, and it is very dire. It's very dire. Yeah. It's really scary. Yes, the amount of poisons that they're putting in our food supply is very scary. Yeah. Mm -hmm. We are. Yeah. All right, well, tell your representative to support the Saving America's Pollinators Act by going to takepart.com slash saveourbees and signing the petition. Is Yo Brain a buzz with bee-centric positivity? If so, let's harness the power of the hive mind and cross-pollinate, share this video with a friend, like it, and make sure to subscribe for more Take Part Live.